Hey everybody, it's Josh the Chevy Pro here at Jack Burford Chevrolet. So today I've got a little special thing I want to do. I want to show you the differences between an LT Trail Boss and a Custom Trail Boss. Stay tuned to find out more. Okay, so first thing you're going to notice on a Custom Trail Boss versus the LT is the front end. I mean, on our custom sport trucks, you've got the Chevrolet across it with the Z71 badging just below it. And of course, then you're gonna have the black face front. You've got different light setups. On the LT Trail Boss, you have the bow tie synonymous with Chevrolet and you've got some LED lighting on the front. A Little bit different look to the grill itself that you can see, but you still get the Z71 badging on it. Now, if you looked at just the wheels back, you're gonna see a lot of very similarities a lot of similarity, very similar, man. Right? Look at my vocabulary. It's similar. It's very similar. So the wheels are going to be the same. We've got running boards. You're going to have the, the same Z71 location on the side. Now, when we get to the mirrors and the handles, on an LT, you're going to have paint, gloss paint, to match the front and the back uh, bumpers, and of course, in the front end. The LT is going to have your passive key entry on it. Your custom is not. So what Chevrolet set out to do was to on a, a custom trail boss to give you a lot of value with what you're purchasing and you're not having to break the bank for it now if you like those features those the tech upgrades the you know maybe you want leather inside of it that's when they come out with the LT trail boss they want to give you that option to go ahead and purchase those things versus having you know just more of a a, a, a workman's truck okay so moving to the back of the vehicle, you're still gonna see a lot of those similarities. Gonna have the Trail Boss on the side. Now on the Chevrolet LT, you're definitely gonna have the LT emblem. On a custom, it's gonna tell you that it's custom. Other than that, if you looked at the back of these vehicles, if you didn't see the LT versus custom, it's gonna be almost identical on the back portion of the vehicle. Now you can see that we've got a sliding rear glass on the LT. Give it a break up that rear window a little bit more. What's my favorite thing, Randy? Capless, capless fill. fill. They both are equipped with a capless fill system for ease of filling up your vehicle. Now, interior is the big changes, as I was saying. On a custom sport trail boss, you have a more basic interior. You've got just your regular mats, you've got you still got that rear air. You're not going to get all the, the storage over here, but you're still going to get a lot of functionality out of the back. Still back a lot of room. Lots of same still amount lots of room. Still lots of room, yeah. It's the same room that are on exactly. both of them. Right. Up front, you're still going to have some similarities like mm -hmm. parking brake, four-wheel drive systems. Now, this one is equipped with a bench seat, so right. you can get that sixth seat. Let me shut this oh, little yeah, off yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. Seat folds up. Nice, yeah. And cool. it does lock into place. Cool. I do like that. Cruise control, you will get a seven inch touchscreen display with the new infotainment three screen, giving you Android Auto, Apple CarPlay technology. You got and still lots of headroom. S same I mean, amount that, of headroom. That extra indention yep. up there, yeah. The sizes of these two vehicles are identical. Identical, nice. But when we move over to the LT Trail Boss, you're gonna notice this one is equipped with a leather interior. Oh yes, 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 yes. Rear storage like. is going to be exactly the exactly same. Exactly the same on this yep. one. Yeah. Exactly the same. Uh, it's going to have more storage in the back, though. Right. You're going to have a bucket seat system here. Mm -hmm. It's going to give you integrated trail brake controller up here with cup holders, which you do have integrated trail brake controller sure. on the other one. Right. You've got an eight inch touch screen here, dual climate control. Right. Did you say more room in the back? Exactly the same, same? room. Okay, exactly, exactly the same room. Exactly the same room. Okay. And now, leather. Leather. Yeah, the leather power driver seat. Does LT get... stand for leather trim? No, unfortunately <laughs> it does not. <laughs> um, but know. it is two, right. um, two ends of the, the trim level spectrum that right. you're going to notice a lot I got of. You. I got you. Um, so, because there's eight different trim levels sure. on the Silverado this year. Right. And it can be very confusing, but that's why us here at Jack Burford Chevrolet were specifically trained on these trucks to be yep. able to help you decide or help assist you along that purchase process right. yeah. and show you the differences that way you can make ultimately the, the decision that you would like sure. on which truck and trim level you'd like to go Absolutely. with 
So, I mean, those are just the two different changes. Now, the biggest change of the two, and I've saved this for the last because mm -hmm. this is, we want to move backwards here, Randy. Sure. Because this is where the, the two trucks really get different. This engine is a 5.3 liter V8. 5.3 liter. Okay, active fuel management, and what is that? Active fuel management is a cylinder shutdown system from a eight cylinder to a four cylinder. Gotcha. Okay. This truck is a 5.3 liter V8 dynamic fuel management. And dynamic is what? There's 17 different combinations that this engine can run off. It can run off two, four, six cylinders. Wow. It's gonna give you the, the most performance. Right. Because this is a new engine Chevrolet has brought out. That is how another big difference you're gonna have in these mm -hmm. two. So I mean, cost-wise, you're not going to see a big difference in the cost of it, but wow. it, it, it's the technology that's going to be between a lot. the two. Exactly. And that is a, a big key difference between a custom yeah. and an LT. And an LT. Did, that's good to know, Josh. So, to learn more about these vehicles and other vehicles we have here at Jack Burford Chevrolet, visit us, visit us online 24-7 at jackburford.com. 365 too, Randy. Every day you can visit us online and you can inquire about vehicles. We're scan that QR code. We're not exactly. here. Exactly. We got it. When we're not here, we got the QR codes mm -hmm. on both of these vehicles. And you can look at our YouTube channel. Just don't forget to subscribe to that because we can upload content like this daily. We want you to be informed as we are. We want you to be able to know where to go to find this information. And then we're located at 819 Eastern Bypass here in Richmond, Kentucky. Can't wait to see you. Thanks, Josh. You're welcome, Randy. And of course, shop 24-7-365 at jackburford.com.